Good morning everyone. So it is very early this morning, for me anyway. It's about 6.30, but today we're gonna be heading down to Paris for the diesel holiday season event. It's to celebrate the only the brave pillar of fragrances, and I thought I'd quickly jump on here and show you what I'm wearing to travel down with today. I'm gonna to be catching the Eurostar, by the way, so I'm gonna get a train down to King's Cross, and then we're gonna be jumping on the Eurostar. So anyway, I'm wearing Diesel's latest aviator-styled bomber jacket. I really love the color of this green and the faux fur collar. I've teamed it up with a white t-shirt, crafted pendant, uh, some black skinny jeans, and my Dr. Martin boots. So I'm pretty warm today because it is freezing outside at the moment. I mean, it's not even that cold to be honest with you, but it's just the transition from hot to cold. It just feels so much worse and the fake heat in the house just sort of like dries your skin out. It's horrible. Um, so yeah, I'm feeling very cozy in this jacket, but my cab is outside. So I'm gonna jump in that now, make my way down to Paris and check out the hotel and see what else is going on when we get there. So let's do this. <laughs> to Hotel Sinner. This is an extremely niche hotel. I'll give you guys a little look around, but it's very dark. The guy took us up to our room with a lantern and we've got a vinyl playing at the moment, some tunes. In fact, we better turn that off in case we get done for copyright. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's take a look around. So this is our bedroom. James and I are gonna be sharing this evening. So we've got a sofa at the back some floor to ceiling curtains that I actually really like. And then we've got two single beds pushed together. Behind us is the entrance and wardrobe section. And of course we've got the TV, bookshelf, a giant foot. You never know when you need a giant foot. We have some goodies from Diesel, Spirit of the Brave fragrance, which is part of the Only the Brave pillar. Let's take a look inside here. Very cool. So this was the collaboration between Neymar and Diesel. And this is actually my favorite fragrance out of the Diesel Only The Brave Pillar. The bergamot is probably the key ingredient in it for me uh, that I really enjoy. So thank you Diesel for hooking me up with another bottle of this and they've also got some shower gel and stuff in here James I'm trying to be a little bit better in the minute but it would be rude not to right this is where the good stuff's at the mini bar so we've got some sweets merch and some alcohol and I really really like these glasses Ooh. it's a well stocked mini bar yeah. got everything and then we whip around, here is our bathroom. What up? <laughs> this is like a his and her sink, but not side by side. And it's a his and his sink today. And then I'm guessing this is the shower. Oh, that's cool, that's a big room. Wow, the bathroom in it as well, yeah. Very cool. It's one of the closets. I like that, little lamp in it, pretty funky. Oh James, I've got some dumbbells in here. I know mate, but it's 5, 5kg, it's too much for me. Yeah, right. Okay, bro. Big news. You can see me holding my belly there in the reflection. I'm so <laughs> hungry. It was a hard decision whether to actually show you or whether just to demolish it, but underneath pot number one, very exciting moment. Wow. We have Parma with tomato. Beautiful. I don't know what accent that was. In fact, that's hilarious. Look. That doesn't actually fit over the pizza. <laughs> so the pizza sticks out the side. <laughs> and then, feast number two, croque monsieur, my personal favorite. Absolutely love it. And then we've got a couple of Cokes with metal straws. That's what we like to see. 
And so we're going to tuck into this ahead of the party this evening, which I'll check in before we head out anyway, because uh, I'm going to show you this evening's outfit again, um, because we're switching it up. That is seriously good, crop my shoulder. Normally they're really like greasy and, I don't know. Oh, we'll have to sin after this, won't we? Right, this is gluttony. Yeah, this is gluttony. <laughs> this is the definition of sin. <laughs> Full on stoppage face. I was just so hungry, I couldn't work out why. I've got haddock on the way down it to be healthy. No. <laughs> the only thing we've got to do is after tomato ketchup. You kidding me? What? Barbecue sauce. That is sin. To dip this food in ketchup and barbecue sauce. No, it's not. That's perfect. That's Mickey Pelican's thing where he's like, uh, he says yes, yeah. I had to get the ketchup. I was having the risotto. <laughs> I don't know, have you not seen his scene where he goes, do you know when you go into a really posh restaurant? And the wife says, go on, ask me for some sauce. So he called the waiter over, he says, excuse me sir, can I have some Tommy K please? And they go off, and they come back, and they've got a little white pot. And he put it down on the table, and I say, is that my tomato ketchup? And they say, yeah, he goes, oh. And I dip my chip in it, and I have a bar, and I say, that's perfect. I'll have a bottle, please. Yeah. <laughs> Right guys, so I've just finished off getting ready for this evening's party with Diesel and I thought I'd quickly show you my outfit of the evening. I've gone for this really cool burgundy bomber that I got gifted in store the other day. You can see it says Diesel on the back. Underneath, I've got a plain black t-shirt with a Serge Denim pendant. Spin around to the full length mirror. I've got some black distressed jeans on. They've got a nice light wash over the front of them as well so they're not solid black. And then my favorite item, are these camo diesel boots that they're kind of like outerwear boots they look like really robust heavy duty so they're going to be great for the winter uh, but of course styling this evening street style yeah that's my look of the evening so i'm going to finish off my look by spritzing some spirit of the brave from diesel and then we're going to head down and enjoy the party this evening so let's do this <laughs> very early today uh, last night was great fun we went upstairs to the whole top floor actually here at the Sinner Hotel Diesel would hide it out and there was like canapes and a DJ and there was a live performance as well it was uh, very chilled we just had a few drinks and then last night I think we got to bed at about midnight or just gone midnight yeah I was got I tossed and turned quite a lot in the night um, but I said to James Let's get up super early tomorrow and get to the Louvre. Try and get there before it gets like crazy busy. So he was like, okay, no problem. Um, what time do you want to get up? I was just like, well, to sort of be there before everybody else, you need to get there before eight. So I think we should get there at like 6.30. So if we get up at like six, quarter to six, then we'll be able to get ready, head over, shoot, and then we can come back and have breakfast and stuff. And he was like, yeah, okay, no problem. So we woke up this morning and I just looked out the window I'm like, ooh, it's rather dark out there today. It's literally still pitch black. This camera does a very good job of making it look lighter than it is. It is pitch black. And James and I have got two hours until the sun rises. <laughs> oh, absolute epic fail, epic fail. So just come down to the restaurant for breakfast this morning. It's quite a vibe in here, as you can see, still very dark outside. <laughs> when your outfit fits in with the decor. Oh yeah. 
James, grab one of those for us. You little fat. <laughs> hot and fresh. Are they hot? They're fresh. There's a warmness to them. Wow. Hot. There's a warmness. Ooh. Pastry. Mm. That bread looks like a bit sweet as well. It looks yellowy. This is a very happy French moment right now. I've got the coffee, the croissants. I could not be a happier boy. Bonjour. Oh, it's cold out there today. Oh, it's a little bit wet as well, boy. <laughs> Look at that, guys. I love this bit. Guys, we have arrived at the Louvre. It's a little bit blue. We're going to do it. Merci. 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 Passe une bonne journée. Bonjour. Bonjour. Oh. James, you've left your wallet and your earbuds. Cash. It's all right, mate. Oh yes. So this is current views at 8 a.m. in Paris. It's actually quite quiet. I thought it was gonna be a lot busier. But I mean, look at that beauty. Absolutely incredible. So this is the roof of the museum, which is pretty epic. And the queues are already starting. Well, that was a successful morning. I think it went quite well. It was absolutely freezing. Like my hands just went completely numb. It was so cold. Um, but we got out there, we beat the crowds, we got the shot, I think, and uh, we came back to the hotel and we actually just chilled out here for about an hour and a half, uh, packed all our stuff up ready to go and we're now going to be heading back to London. So I thought this would be a good time to wrap up the vlog. So massive thank you to Diesel for inviting me out here to Paris and of course I'll leave the link down below to the Brave Pillar and Spirit of the Brave, uh, which is the fragrance that I was wearing during my stay. And uh, we'll be catching you guys. Oof. I might, I might vlog tomorrow. Yeah, I'll vlog tomorrow. Peace.